difficult for me to swallow. But... This is Randy's moment. This is her special day. Let's just work through this. We're going to be there at the wedding, but we won't support it. I have huge concerns that my family will boycott the wedding. They could walk out any second and say, this is stupid. Why are you doing this? And leave. I love my sister so much. And I usually, you know, on Randy's side, but I couldn't do it this time. I can't do it. I just can't. This weather sucks. Yeah. But it is an Irish wedding. It is very dreary. The wedding finally started. We headed out in our groups. We're not sure where everybody's at emotionally, and we're not sure if everybody's even participating. I saw the people in back of me who were Randy's friends, and I was listening to their comments, and I just kept hearing, I can't believe she's doing this. Is he really the groom? Randy's getting married, and her sister and her two brothers are not behind her at all. I still don't know if Melanie is going to be a part of the wedding. And if she isn't, that's something Randy's going to have to deal with. Your sister is really, really upset with you. I was walking out with Bobby. I was like praying, like, please, bring me something happened and don't go through with this. Like, this was supposed to be your wedding, and I hated it. Wow. I'm just glad everyone's here. In the end, my siblings did come, but they were so upset with me. If my real wedding was going like this, I'd call it off because there's no way that I wouldn't have the blessing of my siblings. The only reason why I keep going is because I just hope my family is going to gain from this. I'll catch you if you fall. <laughs> Walking Randy to the ceremony was emotional for me. I'm losing Randy in the way that I know her. And so there's a sadness to that that's, that's setting in on me. You're really gonna do this, Randy? Yep. Because you love Steve. Mm -hmm. And you'll love him your whole life. Mm -hmm. Till the end. Dun, dun, dun. All right, oh, here we go, Daddy. Don't cry. I'm in the home stretch right now. I've gotten my family to believe this whole fake thing. They believed it so much that they're freaking out about it. I am so scared of their reaction. I cannot 
guess what their reaction is going to be. I just hope they don't hate me in the end. How you doing? Great. To the end. We still have to get to the finish line, and that means that Steve and I both have to say, I do. And if we don't get any objections, then we win. Friends, we are gathered here today to celebrate the love of Randy and Stephen. We are deeply grateful to them for inviting us to witness and share in this precious moment. As the ceremony was going on, I looked left several times, and Kathy looked the best, but the other three were just really ticked off. Randy and Stephen, as the years go by, may you find more and more love in each other. It was killing Randy to watch her family suffer. Randy is a very kind person. It was never her attention to cause any pain. Present the rings, please. Stephen, please repeat after me. Randy, I give you this ring as a pledge of my love and as a symbol of our unity. Randy, I give you this ring as a pledge of my love and a symbol of my unit. <laughs> and a symbol of my, our unit. unit. Okay. <laughs> now, Randy, in placing the ring on Stephen's left hand, please repeat after me. Stephen, I give you this ring as a pledge of my love and as a symbol of our unity. Stephen, I give you this ring as a pledge of my love and a symbol of our unity. If anyone objects to this marriage, we are all angry and sad and in disbelief. I was like, I was biting my lip. Oh God, I wanted to protest so bad. Please speak now or forever hold your peace. She's just thinking about herself and not about our family. That's why I, I can't accept it and I'm not going to accept it. If anyone objects to this marriage, please speak now or forever hold your peace. about stressful scared to death I was dying I was vice gripping my mom and my sister to keep them down from not saying anything I don't know what kept myself from standing up and saying I object to this whole marriage I was just at that point where I'm just like this is what Randy wants so let her have it I was looking at my family's face, so pissed off. I was seeing my friends' faces, looking at me going, oh my gosh. And I'm going, okay, let's just go, let's just go. You could just uh, see the relief on her face. And as far as she was concerned, we just won. Uh, all that was left to do were the I do's. And uh, she knew we couldn't possibly screw those up. Randy, do you take Steven to be your husband, to love him, to cherish him, and to continually bestow upon him our heart's deepest devotion. I do. No matter how much I disagreed with her decision, I just came to reality. This is it. It's over. Her whole childhood flashed in front of my face, and her future just all kind of hit me. She was right there. All that was left for me to do is say I do, and the money was in the bank. Steve, do you take Randy to be your wife, to love her, to cherish her? But it was time for one last twist. Randy didn't know that I was about to blow the whole thing. And to continually bestow upon her your heart's deepest devotion. 